Greetings to all Rotarians, sponsors and potential supporters of this project of the Rarotonga Mobile Medical Health Unit. We are the team from Marston and South who've been there and been investigating and putting together this project. If I can introduce myself, I am David Baker uh, doing the effective project management, Dr Rob Irwin doing the medical side and Paul uh, Snellgrove who is the owner of the bus company who's supplying the bus and doing the fit out. Hi, I'm Robert, Rob Irwin, I'm the um, Director of International at Marston South Rotary. Um, David Baker's been doing a huge amount of work over the last three months and so he's actually our project manager for this Rarotonga project and Paul has been incredibly generous with regard to giving us this bus at a very, very reasonable rate and he's going to change it all for us. So um, we're a good team and uh, we're in a very good space at the moment. All we need now is a little bit of financial help from all our fellow Rotarians. Hi, I'm Paul Snilgrove, as already introduced, the owner of Transit. Uh, we're very pleased to be involved with this uh, Rotary project. The particular vehicle we're standing beside is a MAN 10-155. It has a rear engine diesel Cummings and an Allison transmission. It's very easy to be serviced, parts available anywhere in the world. We're still running several of these in our fleet today, the school buses, so parts will not be a problem. The bus we are providing has been provided at uh, current valuation, and uh, well, it's well below valuation in fact, and the work being done to the interior has been done at wage cost only, and parts have been procured at cost only. Well this is engine bay of the vehicle you'll be getting. Over here, all this area here is removed. It'll be for either wood tanks or battery packs for the converter. So that gives an indication rear engine. This here will be the uh, centre door, twin door type bus you'll be getting in Maratonga. Two centre doors open where you like and it's wheelchair red. All the seats in the vehicle are coming out. These seats here come out. What we're suggesting is to leave these seats in yep. for the carry two passengers and around here we'll have a curtain and this will be the changing room for when they go into the medical centre itself. The medical chair will be in this area here, all these seats are removed, the medical chair in here and through here is the centre door with a ramp if anyone has to come in on wheelchair or crutches. All up in the top there we envisage will be for uh, office space, uh, storage. In this area here we're looking at removing the seat here and in this area here, put in the inverter and the deep cell batteries for the inverter. The reason being, uh, we need all the equipment in New Zealand because it's the weight issue we have, We've got to distribute the weight evenly around the whole bus. If the inverter and batteries are here, will they be in the rear of the bus? It depends on the weight. 